Hey y'all, it's your boy Alex here. And you know, I know I'm a few weeks late to this topic, but there is something I just really want to speak on. It's these protests surrounding George Floyd's murder. Now, I'm not gonna say, you know, I'm not I'm not gonna say whether or not he should have been killed or whether or not he shouldn't. Because that's not my decision to make. What is my decision to make, though, however, is this. Let me just say this. To George Floyd, our hearts go out to you. As this guy is no longer with us. To the family members, friends, and colleagues of George Floyd, our hearts also go out to all of you guys. To Floyd and everybody affected by his death, we feel sorry for you, and our hearts go out to you folks. But as for the rest of y'all, fuck y'all. Seriously, fuck y'all. Fuck all of y'all. First of all, you know, I get this thing would kind of cause a lot of outrage and stuff, but here's my question. What exactly are these people protesting about? Because I got no fucking clue. What are these people protesting for? To... Defund police? I've heard that before. Defund the police station. Why would we defund the police? We need the police to protect us in our lives. And now, you got people claiming that, oh, because the police are bad people and this, this, and that. Newsflash, most cops are good people. They protect the citizens of your community. They protect you, even, as a matter of fact. So to justify the fact that we need to defund the police is completely idiotic. I mean, just because one cop does something wrong doesn't mean that they're all bad. This whole thing surrounded Floyd has just gotten so out of proportion, even a few weeks later after his death. <clears throat> you want to know what? Here's the next thing I want to mention. I already said I don't get why people are protesting. Because... You know, I, I, I just don't know what there is to protest about. I really j just don't. But the main problem I have is, you know, guys, for everyone who wants to, like, to change stuff and all of this, you know, going on, whatever the hell you want to do. There have been many, many men like Floyd before him, before his death. Probably before his birth, as a matter of fact. This kind of thing has happened a lot. You had multiple, multiple, multiple times along the scale of multiple, multiple years to change this. To go out and protest and actually let your voice be heard. Why is 2020 the last straw? When... The last time you heard... A guy getting shot by a cop in your community. Or even shot by anyone, as a matter of fact. You could have gone out and did something right then and there. We had many times to call for this. But why do you wait till practically the last minute? When all these years have gone by and all of those lives have been lost. Why is this year the last straw? I, I just don't get it. I mean, this whole drama surrounding George Floyd. I think it really is ridiculous. I think it really is ridiculous. And there's much more to say about besides Are you kidding me? Next time something goes on that you don't like, actually try going out and stopping it. And for God's sakes, don't call to defund the whole police deal just because of one cop that probably doesn't even live in your state. Well, you wanna know what? This your boy Alex. I'm out of here.